Hi, I'm Buddy Johnson, Hillsborough County Supervisor of Elections. I'm pleased to introduce you to our new voting system with a paper trail. Many of you have probably completed a form where you fill in the ovals on a sheet similar to this. Casting your vote will be just as easy. With the new optical scan voting system, you'll cast your vote by simply filling in the ovals on a paper ballot. It's my pleasure to implement this new system, and you have my pledge that the new system is safe, reliable, and easy to use. It provides a paper trail to ensure every vote counts. Please enjoy this brief overview that will take you through everything you need to know about voting with our new system. Hi, I'm Phil, oval filler extraordinaire, champion of democracy, guru of ink. When it comes to our new voting system, no one fills you in better than me. So let's get started. First, arrive at your polling site. Polls are open from 7 a.m. to 7 p.m. Your precinct number is listed on your voter information card. Or call our office or use the precinct finder on our website. Bring your driver's license or other authorized photo and signature identification with you. Confirm your voter information and sign in. You'll then receive your paper ballot in secrecy folder. Take your ballot in secrecy folder to the next available privacy booth. Very simple. Read the instructions on the ballot and pay close attention to the number of candidates you may vote for in each contest. Fill in the ovals completely next to the candidate or issue of your choice in each contest. Check both sides of your ballot to ensure you voted for every candidate or issue you choose. If you make a mistake while marking your ballot, take it to an election official and replace it with a new one. If you do make a mistake, don't worry. You can replace your ballot up to two times. <sighs> when you've finished marking your ballot, take it to the optical scan vote tabulator. If you choose, you may place the ballot inside the secrecy folder provided. If you have questions or uncertainty about how to scan your ballot, please be sure to ask one of the precinct election officials for assistance. They're there to help. Take your ballot out of the secrecy folder and feed it into the slot on the optical scan vote tabulator. You may place your ballot in facing up or down. Your vote will be recorded and counted, and your ballot will be stored safely inside. The tabulator will reject your ballot if you overvote, which means you've marked more than one choice in a contest. You can either tell the precinct election official you want to cast the ballot as is, or request another ballot to make the revision. Once your ballot is cast, it cannot be retrieved. It's now secure in the locked ballot box as your paper trail, if there's ever a recount. So that's the basics. Pretty easy, huh? And this new system also makes it easy for people with disabilities to vote. In choosing our new voting system, it was very important that we secure a system that works for voters with disabilities and limited dexterity. The Automark Assist Terminal serves voters who are blind, vision impaired, or have a disability or condition that would make it difficult or impossible to mark a ballot in the usual way. And, of course, all voting locations will offer equal accessibility and privacy. Voter turnout is expected to be high this year, but you can avoid lines and vote right from your home or wherever you choose with our request a ballot service. And remember, mailed in ballots are counted first on election night. Request your mailed in ballot with no excuses required. Contact us to learn more. Another way to save time is to take advantage of early voting at 13 convenient locations. Call us or check our website for dates and locations. And before you even head to the polls, make sure you're registered and that your voter registration information is current. The Florida Voter Registration Application is available at our offices, Hillsborough County Public Libraries, and on our website, or call us to request one to be mailed to you. You can also use this application form to update your records and signature. If your signature has changed since you registered to vote, you'll need to update it and may do so up until the day of elections. It's important. If you're a registered Hillsborough County voter, you'll receive a sample ballot by mail. Study this ballot, familiarize yourself with candidates and proposed law changes, and fill it out to use as a guide on voting day. It'll make voting much faster for everyone. In this historic presidential election year, the two big dates to remember are the primary election on August 26th and the general election on November 4th. 
but there are also deadlines for registering, to request a ballot, and specific dates for early voting. Contact us to review these important dates. You are now officially filled in. Thank you, and don't forget to make your mark. Your vote is a cherished right, and I am dedicated to making it count. If you have any questions about our new voting system or voting in general, please contact my office. We look forward to serving you during this presidential election year. And see me on YouTube.